Good afternoon, lovely children. Now that you know what semitones are and what sharps and flats and naturals are, let's see if you can hear them. So I'm going to play two notes, and I want you to tell me if the second note is higher or lower than the first note. If it's higher than the first note, then you should be writing sharp. If it's lower than the first note, you should be writing flat. I might try and trick you and play the same note twice, in which case you should be writing natural. All right, here we go. Here's your first note. Here's your second note. You need to tell me if the second note went lower or higher than the first note. Here's your first note again. Second note. Last time. First note. Second note. So if you heard the second note higher, you should have written a sharp. Lower, you should have written a flat. Same note, you should have written a natural. Here is the answer. I played E and E flat. So it did go down. And my trick for flats for semitones going down is the beginning of Furelli's of the amazing Beethoven. Okay, let's do another one. Here's your first note. Here's your second note. Again, here's your first note. Second note. Last time. Here's your first note. And your second note. And here's what I played. C. C sharp. So it did go up. If you wrote a sharp, you were correct. Now, my trick for sharps is... It is the very, very famous two notes that scared everybody in Jaws, written by the amazing, incredible John Williams. So that is a sharp. Okay, another one. Here we go. First note. Second note. I'm going to play it again. First note. Second note. Third time, first note, second note, and here's the answer. I played an A, and then another A. So if you wrote down they were the same, you are correct. Or if you had written that it was a natural, you are correct. Let's try a couple more. I'm going to play it again. time. If you guessed flat, you were correct. Here's another one. Again. One more time. If you guessed flat, you are correct. B and B flat. Another one. Again. One last time. If you heard a natural, you are correct. They were both G's, same note. One more. Again. Last time. And here's the answer, F, F sharp. Now, you don't have to write the letter F and the letter and then letter F sharp. You just have to write that the second note was higher, right? So, that was a sharp. 
So yeah, I don't expect you to be able to hear the names of the notes. Like you shouldn't be able, to, it's very rare people that can say that that's an F without looking at the keyboard. You just need to tell me if the second note was sharp, flat, or natural. All right, I hope I haven't confused you. See you later.